we've been trying to get this together, man. Shoot. Sure. I don't know. We've been Three back Mars and forth? Yeah. yeah, bro. Right. We've been back and forth on it a lot. And, you know, so I've been able to really dive into, like, what got you here. And I always find it um, interesting when you talk to someone who's, like, you know, the, the child of an immigrant, yeah. you know, and, and, and the, the level of excellence yeah. they set for their children. What was that like for you growing up, knowing you had that certain level of expectation? Well, for me, you know, I was the only child, you know, so being uh, parents of first Nigerians, uh, it's, it's hard because excellence is expected yeah. at every, every, every turn. So my dad will always be like, you got one shot to make an impression. So make it count. So if you want to be a soccer player, make sure you, you score on the goal, or you the fastest, or this. You want to watch dishes, make sure you do this. So having that mindset translated to what I do now. Like, I don't know, I, I treat everything as I only have one shot, and, it, and, it, and it's formed my lifestyle. It's funny that you say that, because to get where you are, you know, international superstars, going on tours and all that, and we as athletes, I've, you know, we've had athletes in the past, is greatness, and I'm giving you your flowers. 100%. Like Fred's shirt. Thank you. Thank you. Do you think it was, like, were you born with that, or was that created? I think it's a mixture of both, man. You know, like, having parents that guide that greatness is important. Because if they don't guide it, then it's just somebody with potential. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? It never shows out. But my mom knew that greatness was in me, man, when, um, when she was pregnant. She had, she had a dream when she was seven months pregnant, and Bob Marley came to her and said, your son is going to finish my legacy. So that changed the mindset of a woman who's you have to be, as a Nigerian, you got to be a doctor, a lawyer, a, a dentist, you know what I mean? Yeah. So that changed the mindset of, like, oh, I have something really special. And having a woman, like, who's a spiritual warrior, you know, a prayer warrior, since I was born, it was like, okay, let's, let's, if this is who you are, let's follow it. And so I've always had that. So I knew I was, but they also knew, and that was just equally as important.